journey for Healthy and Me. Today is March the 11th. Yes, it is. Um, I'm on my way to go have a colonic. I am not constipated. That's not why. I think I'm trying to detox. I'm having headaches and I felt kind of dizzy this morning and like I wanted to vomit. So um, I've had three large BMs. I know that's TMI. So I know I am not constipated. I feel like my body is trying to cleanse itself in a deeper way. Um, and I think that since I've been eating raw for the last two months, I think I would get more benefits of having a colonic right now. Um, thanks to my girl Lynette, she advised me that maybe this is necessary. So this is why I'm doing this today. I hope you guys are having a great day and stay focused on your journey. Bye. YouTube is Journey for a Healthier Me. I am here having a colonic done. Um, as my girl Lynette recommended, since I've been eating raw for the last, you know, almost 60 days now that I've been eating raw, and I was feeling a little dizzy today and um, lightheaded, and I defecated a lot. Like this morning, I woke up, had a BM, um, went out to eat. It was a garden burger, but it was made out of um, eggplant. It was just eggplant. <laughs> and um, so that's what I had. And it was made out of, uh, the bread was out of uh, sprouted grains. Um, so that's what I had. And then I went home and I had, it was, both times it was about close to 15 inches, like longer than a ruler. Um, so it was crazy because I'm like, oh my God, I can't believe I have that much. But I was so I had a headache last night um, and then I had a migraine this morning and I felt dizzy after I ate like I was gonna throw up everywhere I was telling Lynette it felt almost like if I was on a merry-go-round and somebody was spinning it real fast and I got off and I felt like I wanted to barf everywhere that's how I felt so I went home and I used the bathroom it was a lot and then um, I went out again and had a little bit of black coffee and then I had to use the bathroom again and it was a, a lot and so I'm like you know what I need to do this today like I felt like I needed to so I just came here and I actually had a good experience I feel really good and the last two times I had a, co uh, a procedure I actually was I had to keep getting up to go to the toilet to release because I couldn't handle the pressure um, and then also, too, I had a lot of gas, a lot of gas those t two times. But I was never really seeing anything go through the tube. This experience, I have not got up whatsoever. I'm actually here with Michelle. I don't know if you guys remember her from my last video. Say hi, Michelle. Hello. And um, I have not got up at all. It's been an hour, pretty much, that I've been on the table. And I've had a lot of stuff come out. Right, Michelle? What do you see now different? A lot of stuff off the walls, some gas. Um, a lot of some mucus, um, just she's had a good release. There's a lot of stuff that had come out that were on the walls that did not, that she, after she had her bowel movement, a lot still was on there, the toxins, yellow water, liver detoxing. So she's had a really good colonic. Um, and this is how it should be. You know, every colonic is always different. But now that she's defecating better now with her raw diet, she's able to get, a lot of stuff out of her colon um, and detox and the diet is helping her uh, detox those from the cells of her body are helping her detox with the colon hydrotherapy she's feeling so much better because she was getting a toxic headache yes I was I was sitting here and I was feeling lightheaded and nauseous and um, and then all of a sudden, right there through the tube, there it went, you know, and then it went away. And it was crazy that that's what it was that was causing me that. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you, Lynette, and thank you, Michelle, for helping me You're welcome. feel better. <laughs> all right, you guys, talk to you later. Bye.